few points I want to cover. Uh, we talk a lot about turning double plays, and when you turn a double play, you have to give up something to get something. So we're going to give up that base hit in the hole to the left side so that we can turn a double play. Uh, the first thing that we do is we got to move in from normal double play or regular play depth. We got to move in. So we got to move in. And we got to move closer to the bag, and that's what we call double play depth. So we're closer to the bag, and we're closer to the batter, so that we can get to the ball sooner, so that we can turn two. play is going to be a ground ball that's right at you or to your right and what you want to do is you want to make sure you get down first things first you got to catch the ball first you always got to catch the ball if you're going to turn two once you catch the ball and this is the ball once I said again it's directly at you or to your right you're going to catch the ball and you're going to flip it to the shortstop There's two points when you're flipping the ball to the shortstop you want to flip the ball with a stiff wrist so that your ball has a direct flight to the shortstop. You don't want any loopiness in your flip or the ball's gonna go up in the air and it's not gonna be a good flip. The second thing is, after you flip the ball, you follow your flip. And that'll get the right hardness of your flip so that you can get to the shortstop in time. The next play I wanna talk about is the ball that's to your left that you can still get in front of. And what you're gonna do here is you're gonna move your feet you're going to get in front of the baseball once again. Most important thing is catch it. And what we do here now is we're going to step back with our right leg. We're going to step back so that we clear our right side so that we can make a throw uphill. And it's very important you throw the ball uphill to the shortstop because it makes it easier to catch. If you do this and stand up and throw the ball downhill, as you can see, it's a very tough play for the shortstop. You always want to throw the ball uphill from a second baseman throwing to the shortstop so he has an easy play. The last play I want to talk about is the ball that you really have to move to your left. So we're going to go a long way here. We're going to catch the ball off our left foot and then we're going to plant with our right foot. We're actually going to turn our back to the base runner so that we can make a good strong throw and once again we're going to throw it uphill. And that'll give our shortstop time to catch the ball and throw the ball to first base.